Oh, the stupid monkey showed up right in front of me. I hate this monkey. I hate this monkey so much. How's it going, everyone? Welcome back to Flint's Place. We're continuing the Drags Collection. This time, we're going to take a look at this game, The Thing in the Lake by Pansez. Something horrible is hiding in this murky depths. This is by the developer of World of Horror, which I played both the demo and a bit of the full game, I believe, on a stream. So let's first check out the content page. I didn't really have an in-game in mind. You got that one already. That's what I keep coming back to. Uh, this one. I was Disney trying to note. call the entire time. I hadn't called mom yet to let her know I was going back to check on you. Whatever. It's not like I was staying. Alive, dead, somewhere in between. I just needed to know. I didn't want to spend the rest of my life wondering. So I kept calling. And my phone died. Emptied by my persistence. A little reminder that this wasn't all just a dream. Okay. Yeah, there's definitely something cataclysmic happening there. And we're looking for this one. Perfect. Why did the label turn red just then? A little weird. Wow. Okay, first we gotta do the whole focusing thing. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. I am sorry about what you see there. I'm gonna have to fix that. There we go. Move it over so a little bit so you can see it. Oh, of course. And then, then it's like, oh yeah, I'll just go full screen. That's fine. Thanks. Thanks, game. <laughs> Real professional job I do here. Much better, I guess? Close enough. A man reminiscing his past gets caught in a string of mysterious murders at an abandoned summer camp in eastern Poland. Every macabre clue he finds points towards the thing in the lake, hiding in its murky deaths. Let's go check out the Dark Carnival. A group of... Uh, 8th June 1992, 4.15pm. A group of friends broke into an abandoned summer camp to relax for two weeks of exams. Kaiza, a gallant girl and veterinary student, has arrived earlier to sit up the tents near the lake. She doesn't yet know that she's being watched by something evil. Will she survive the evening until her friends find a way to the camp, or will she become yet another macabre exhibit in the Dark Carnival? Finally, I set up the tent. The guy said they would arrive later in the evening. I guess I can explore the camp a bit. If my friends didn't mess up, with, mess up the directions, they should arrive by the main gate, which is west from here. Okay, well, it's good that you're... Oh, wow, that's like... Uh, that's kind of cute. So they should show up here. Oh. I don't know what just happened. Some locations that the closed gate can be interacted with. I need the resort key to open it. All right, well, let's go try to find the resort key. I was not expecting this, to be completely honest. Can I do I want to click? Oh, it's closed. Okay. Outhouse. Can I go into the outhouse? No. Okay. Well, oh, I spot a map of the entire lake area. It's water damage and mostly unreadable, but one thing catches your eye. Someone has marked an island on the lake with an X mark. You wonder why. Let me just move the, the microphone a little bit. There we go. It felt weird. Like, I felt like it was too low. It's throwing me off. So in the center of the lake, there's an X. I guess we're going to have to go check that out. But we don't have a boat here. Is this a door? No, I think that's a tree. I mean, basically, it's like a, it's like a door. It can make doors, you can make doors with trees. Now, it looks like there's another note here, too. A new note. Would you like to read it now? Of course I would like to read it now. Warmian Mazurian Voivode Ship's History. Don't know what that is. The hills around Zernberg Lake are hiding many ancient pagan temples, and the people believe that their god lived in the lake itself. To this day, researchers find bones, tools, and coins thrown into the lake to appease the being. Retrieved sacrificial artifacts can be found in the Slamaxi Open Air Museum in... Well, I guess I don't care that much. Can I go swimming? I guess I can't go swimming. Maybe this little gap here? No. Alright, I guess we're gonna head... Is there, like, a boat that I'm not seeing here or something I can check out? Oh, there's a ser- oh, old pier. Oh, uh, I guess... It should have for a second I said old pier, but... Yeah, there it goes. An old pier. I can go down here, though, and check this out. That looked like a monkey. Or a gorilla. A new note. Yeah, of course. Um, Bajka Circus presents the 1981 season show. 
This is the Bajka Circus, and be prepared for a night of laughs, gas, and incredible sights you won't believe. Funny clowns, piano playing dog, Igor the Terrible. Firework show every night, probably. Uh, fortune teller. It actually, look like it says Sherry. And blood sacrifices, I'm pretty sure that's what this is supposed to say. Dancing chickens, exotic ape and his trainer. Take your friends and enjoy the show. I think the ape's still here. It looks to be just kind of... Oh, God. Hello, Mr. Monkey Boy. The great ape observes you from behind the bars of its gate. The horrible smells make your eyes water as you get closer. Okay. We're just, oh, no. Don't... Please don't attack me, Mr. Monkey Man. Ow. That hurt? Did that attack me? I don't know what just happened there. Oh, okay. I was going to say, am I being blocked by my own cursor? But it doesn't seem like that's the case. So, shift the sprint. Is it going to come after me? I don't want it to come after me. It looks like stairs. No? Not stairs? Okay, it's not stairs. Well, then. Oh, he's angry. He's super duper. Oh, do I, can I just... No, I can't. Is it? That's not hurting me, right? I don't think that is. I think that's just me walking through grass. That's what it seems like, at least. So, do I want to check this out? Or go closer to the monkey? Hello. Hello, friend. Can we talk? I can't talk to him. I want to see what he's up to. He might be doing something cool. Oh, it's a, like a walkway. Oh, this is actually a building, I think. Let's see. Oh, there's someone here. I, I go back to the or go back to the tent, is all it says. Oh, great. Oh, boy. Oh, that's just fantastic. The monkey's here. Uh, let's go this way because this will be a lot easier to get away. Find a place to hide. Um, like here? No. Go down. Ow! It took seconds for the giant ape to catch up with Cassia, and even less time to rip her head out and throw it away. The very last thing her eyes registered was a man standing behind the ape in the distance. The ritual has begun. Chapter 1 complete. Okay. <laughs> now let's go check out chapter 2. I guess that that's the ending? Because I didn't... There was really no way for me to get away from that. There's no way I could have sped away. Uh, 8th of June, 1992. Despite the car problems, two friends, Poiter, uh, po Poiter and Marson. Again, I don't know the language, to be completely honest. Probably butchering that name. Also, apologies for burping. I don't know if you actually heard that. Uh, finally arrived at the abandoned camp. Or did they? The dirt road they took suddenly ended in a dead end. The path forward is overgrown with plants slowly reclaiming the ruined bird buildings. Will they find their way out of the forest, or will they get lost in tall grass? Press space to continue. Damn. They were lost, man. I told you we took the wrong turn. I'm sure the camp's right past the gate. We just need to find something to break the rusty lock with. Okay, he's just running off. Grab the beer case. Find something to... I got a map, yep. Yeah. One thing to catch your eye, someone's marked an island, yeah. Grab the beer case. You can now access your inventory with space. Great. I have a beer case. Well, you know, gotta get the essentials, I guess. That's fine. Be careful. Walking in the tall grass is really loud. Wait, someone's coming. Behind the trees, you see a short man in a red cape, walking seemingly, seem, seemingly aimlessly. Oh. Okay. Yeah, he just... He... He just... Got... Like... Like, can we... Can we talk about what just happened? Our friend just got, like... Brutally exploded by some guy with a knife. Star Resort ad. Built in 1961, the Star Resort allows for a luxurious rest for the whole family with all the modern amenities, including a standing fan and a TV in every room. Make sure to check out our pool and the two beach volleyball courts. Something happened on the screen, too. I don't know what that was, though. Alright, so don't walk in the tall grass, but the short grass might be okay? I think? Seems like this is okay. All right, let's go the long way around. Oh, I was worried I got too close to that. Uh, okay. Oh, I think there was a crowbar I picked up. All right, so we're not we're not gonna just like mourn our our friend who had just died or anything like that. We're just we're just gonna break open the gate and then yep, yeah, that's yeah, that's pretty much what it seems like we're doing. Cool. All right, well, good to know. Well, at least I can go. There we go, we're through here. Avoid the tall grass still. Board up gate, now it's now that's open. Oh. 
Why are there loud? What did I just get? That is a blue gem. I was gonna say, did I just... Oh, no, 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 no. See, this door is a trick. A Monty game. Post-Soviet monument. Okay. That's... Alright, that seems kind of weird, but sure. We'll go with that. Oh. Oh, that's us. That's us. I think. From when we were in there earlier. Find a way to meet your friend. Oh, she's about to get murdered by a gorilla. Oh, I almost walked right to that grass. That would have been very bad. Okay, this seems like we're okay. Is this closed? This is closed. There's a gate there, though. Can I open the gate? With the crowbar? Oh, I don't know what just happened there, but... Crowbar? No. Oh! Right, the gorilla. Okay, yeah, our friend's dead. We should just ig ig ignore all of that. Uh, find a way to meet your friend. Can I just leave? I think there's a street right there. Nope, okay. Not at all. Lobby Ozrodka Resorts Lobby. I'm gonna die here, aren't I? I'm pretty sure I am. Great. What's in here? Uh, okay. Nothing I really care too much about. So what is this? Do I wanna... Can I use the beer case? No. Probably go to the right, that means. So there's two rights, though. I can go to the bottom right or the top right if I loop around, I think. I'm gonna try that. A new note, yeah, okay. Resort memo. The old lady from room 1408 has lost the key again. I'll bet, I, I'll bet a cigarette pack she's lost in the church. <laughs> 1408, nice. She lost in the church. She's there every day. Cash bonus for anyone, for anyone who finds the key. Okay. That's, that's good. Now we know he can earn a cash bonus by finding the key. I don't know what the key's for, but I'm sure when we get to the church, we'll find a key. An old postcard. The postcard's dated June 1981. Dear SCM, I miss you dearly. The resort here is pretty bad and boring without you. The lake's water smells bad and the pool is overcrowded. The only fun thing here is the circus. The piano playing dog is incredible. The big ape is scary looking, but it listens to every command from his trainer. There's also a freak they call Igor, and he seems to appear from out of nowhere. Spooky. Hope to see you soon. Satsuk. Yeah, I'm worried about Igor. I feel like he's going to be like the big bad guy. Just because of my understanding. Okay. I need I need to find a key for that. It doesn't seem like I'm going to do it. Oh no, the monkey! Oh, the monkey! Oh, can I juke past him? Oh, I can. I did. Awesome. Okay, I probably still want to avoid tall grass though. So we're gonna need to go around. Tall grass needs a weed killer. All right. Well, then I'll go to the right and see what I find here, which is a note. Moly newspaper. Person killed in the boat accident. Tragedy struck something in the Slamazaki community. Iwa something, better known as Madame Mysteria, not 29-year-old, was hit by a motorboat at the Chernobyl. Chernobyl. The body has not yet been recovered. She was survived by her husband. Ben? More than likely is the, the next word. I'm out. Oh, Mr. Monkey, please don't. Right, we're gonna we're gonna go this slowly. Suddenly a bear trap sets off on your onto your leg, tearing the muscles. The pain is sickening. In the distance you can see a hooded figure approaching slowly. Oh crowbar. Crowbar! Crowbar would work. Here, do you want a gem? With one strong swing, the hooded figure frees you both from the bear trap and your leg. Crawling away from the assailant, you feel weaker and weaker until it gets dark. The ritual completes. Alright. Well, let's go check out the Zerny bug. Which I think was what I was actually saying, not Chernobyl. With the ritual coming in just two days, a young aspiring witch, Anna, has been ordered to prepare the ritual site. The head priest of the cult has ordered her to come alone, which troubled Anna, but the perspective of a promotion was more than enough. The murky water has been slowly turning bloody red in Zernbug, the cursed lake. The ritual will begin shortly. I must make sure everything is in place. I'll need both the blessed chalk and the holy candles, but where did they leave it? Okay... Well, we know there's a key here. Yep, we got it. Oh, well we don't have- we, now we have the key. There's also a note up top here. 
Do I want to still avoid the, the grass? I don't know, actually. Uh, it's a farmer's letter, though. Jelzek. I've set up the bear traps around the lake. People are avoiding the place anyway, and maybe we'll get the bear that's killing our sheep. They're well hidden, but you should spot them with no problem if you get closer. That, that's rude, dude. That's real jacked up, man. Call me out for stepping into a bear trap like that. Jerk move, man. Jerk move. Alright, so... What's in here? I can't check that out. Can't go that way either, but this looks like it's... This looks like it's the other side of where that road is that I saw by the entrance. So I'm pretty sure... Okay, I just went through tall grass and didn't have any issues, so that's that's good. Oh, I don't feel safe in here. Let's get it over with fast. Oh, I saw something. Oh, the bear trap shows up when I actually do. Oh, that's bad. Oh, no, bear trap. Oh. You suddenly stop, feeling a weird tickling down your chest. When you look down, you discover a stream of hot blood gushing from your cut neck. You die before your body hits the ground. Alright, so that happened, but on the plus side, I know where I need to go now. Yep, so we get the key first, and then we go up here this way to the graveyard where it's nice and spooky. And she says some words. Yep. And then the monkey shit. What? Oh, I was gonna say, but I'm going to be smart. Oh, I'm so I'm, I'm trapped. Oh, come on. Between the bear trap and the, the killer showing up, the powerful ape begins to tear you limb from limb. In no time, all that's left to you is a wet puddle of gore and ripped clothes. So I think what happened is the first time I died then, it was actually the killer that got me, but it just, it, it just so happens I didn't see, notice the killer at the time. So I ended up uh, just getting murdered without actually seeing who did it. All right, so we can do this. I gotta go to the right, it seems. God, no, that's not good. Oh, so he had okay, got it. He shows up when I step in the bear trap. That's good to know. So I can avoid that. Which I really should be avoiding the bear traps in the first place, but here's a secret. I'm dumb. <laughs> no, I'm just oblivious sometimes with stuff like that. Also, this area is getting like a little panicky. So it's like it's all about going quickly, but also avoiding the bear traps. Remember what I said about avoiding bear traps? <sighs> Remember what I just said about avoiding the bear traps? It doesn't matter what I say. I'm just gonna step in them anyway. Let's let's try this again with a little less dying, if all possible. Alright, so it's up there, over here. Monkey show. Oh, I got a letter. Okay. I destroyed it. The, grunk, the drunk grave digger told me something really interesting today. They buried someone rich in his forgotten cemetery in unmarked tomb. I bet the jeweler is still there with her. Okay, well that's good to know. Also, what's weird is that the monkey hasn't showed up. They say that strange lights appear over the witch's house at night. It seems that even the ape is afraid of this place. Okay, sounds like we're gonna go investigate it. Hopefully without getting our uh, foot caught in a bear trap. Doesn't seem like I'm gonna be able to do this without getting my foot caught in a bear trap. Ow! Nope, that's not good. Okay, got it through. Okay, he's... God! These goddamn bear traps. So there's no point in going to the right. At all. Because... It just tells you about the witch's house. I didn't see anything that actually was letting me do anything with it. I'm just gonna have to go up, I guess, or just go up. But what's also kind of weird is that the monkey's not showing up. The ape's not showing up. Oh, spoke too soon. Spoke too soon. Oh, everyone. Ah, oh, God, I keep forgetting that bear trap is right there. Oh man, and I, I, and I really don't want to start like pausing the recording or editing anything because just stuff happens randomly. So I don't know like when I can expect to be scared or caught by anything. One thing though is that I am getting game overs, which shows me that dying is part of the first three chapters. It just makes sense. 
go this. Maybe it's a, it's a, if I sit. Oh, okay. Let's go this way. All right. Okay. And now. Oh my god, he keeps showing up there. Okay, that's fine. Okay, we're gonna avoid that bear trap. Oh, it's just I'm walking in the tall grass. I get it now. Mm hmm. I just don't want to walk in the tall grass, that's correct. As I'm now learning again. It's just they add, they're adding things to each time. Like now they're adding the bear trap. But what caused the monkey to show up? Is it if I sit, if I stand still too long? Thing? Walking means monkey does not show up. Tall grass means killer does show up. Almost stepped in that bear trap. That's why I want to go around. Oh boy. Oh, I almost did that. I almost big, did the big dome. Well, what if I don't go that way? What if I go to the right here? Anything different? I was going to say, there's going to be a bear trap dead center. I know it. Oh, crap. Oh, no. Oh, he's so fast. He's so fast. I, it seems I can go either way, really. I'm not seeing, like, much of a difference between the two. Because, well, also, I haven't really seen that much of a difference in either spot, because I haven't been to either spot for more than four seconds. But... Maybe if I just, like... I, I don't understand the moment. Doesn't seem like it seems like once you're in a bear trap, you're just done. I'm I'm gonna jump ahead. This is getting really bad. All right, so we're here, and I also discovered there's the story mode, which is actually above the options, which reduces the amount of tall grass and also puts this little overlay where the bear traps are. So that's nice if you're more focused on trying to get the story, like I am, and don't feel like dying repeatedly over and over again. There's your option. That's not great. That's the story mode. That's the that's the button I just hit. I'm gonna jump back in. Okay, I'm back up here. I'm gonna be very careful not to step in that grass or on that bear trap there. And instead, go around. I don't know what happens with like, what triggers the monkey to show up with that, but as long as I can scootaloo around him, I should be all right. Just have to hope he doesn't show up on the left hand side right here because that'd be really bad for me. No, it seems like we're safe. All right, cool. I need a shovel for the unmarked grave. Did see that. Is there anything here I can check out? No. Nothing here that I care about. Please don't let the monkey, sh the ape show up here. What is this? I grabbed the blessed can- or, uh, oh no. I thought that said I grabbed the blessed candle. I got the chalk. Okay, that's what I got. That was a pool? Okay. That's rather weird. And then the, the candles, which was left in one of the rooms. Oh, which was probably going to be... I don't want to go this way, this is bad, because that's all grass. Um... Okay, neat, thanks. God, this monkey. I need weed killer to get the shovel. Which... The weed killer will give me the shovel, probably for the next character. One of the rooms was locked, which is this room over here. I can get... This? Yes. And then... I got bring both the chalk and candles to the island. Okay. Um, quick, just a small, very tiny question. If I were to get to the island, how would I do such a thing? I'd have to, be, it'd be a boat, right? Oh, I almost walked right into that grass. I'd have to use the boat, but I don't remember seeing any boats. There might be a boat by the dock, which was further down. Let's see. Was this way? Oh, that's boarded up gate and he's a crowbar again. Great. Oh, I thought that was really open because the, the crow... Go, 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 go. All right, cool. Ooh, boy, that was close. This... 
I'm very confused now because how do I get to the docks? Oh, nope, that's bad. Oh, I gotta redo everything, don't I? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. All right, I'll get everything again. Don't worry. All right, so I got everything again. I that needs a resort key, which I don't have a resort key to. I don't have the resort key. Everything else is pretty much. This is all closed. I can't even go up there. That's closed. Can't fit through there or anything like that. So I guess we're gonna just have to go back through here. Also, the freaking monkey followed me through the hotel. Okay. When I got the key, it showed up on the other side, and I like had to scoot around it. That's worrisome. Because that bang usually means that that keeps showing up. Yep. See what I mean? See what I mean? This monkey. Total, total jerk. Alright. Can I get away first? Yes. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. That's awesome. So, is there a map? If I hit M or... No. I need to get to... The island on the lake. Where did you go? Good sir. Oh, I can go through here. Oh, that was cool that they showed me that. Virtual site. Oh, it's, it's, okay. That was uh, like a pier. All right, we're gonna put everything there. You knew what you had to do. You undress and lie down on the rock, ready to become one with the colt. Hearing the chainsaw, you pray it'll be over quickly. Wow, that's dark and out of nowhere. But there we go. Oh, so story mode shows up. It's, it probably shows up after you die a few times. That's nice. A man reminiscing his past gets caught in a string of mysterious murders at an abandoned summer camp in eastern Poland. What's the connection between him and the mysterious lake? All questions will finally be answered in Lovecrafting. Oh, I don't know if I talked about this before, but the theme of uh, Dread X Collection 2 was Lovecraft, Lovecraftian. Uh, just kind of playing off, I guess, the Eldritch Horror theme or in Sucker for Love, legitimately crafting love. I thought that was cute. Finish the ritual while avoiding the killers. Oh, okay, cool. Oh, okay, so, oh, no, monkey. Oh, oh, not good. All right, that was, that was my fault. I will admit I, I, I stepped in the grass there. But now I gotta get to, oh, okay, uh, right, the bear traps aren't gonna show up because this is not, this is not story mode. Where the hell am I? I don't actually know where I am. Do I have anything in my inventory? No. I just have eight stamina. What is this area? What did I just get? Head? And... Right arm. Uh-huh. The body parts of the girl are getting dark and swollen. Clean the fly larva from the head. These will do just fine. Oh, so that was the girl we were just... That just got dismembered as part of it. Oh, come on, Mr. Monkey. Not in the mood for your bananas. There we go, we're fine. See? No, no sweat. No sweat. We're perfect. Entering a familiar camp, you don't you can't help but feel a bit, little bit nostalgic for the good times you both had spent here. There's something over there. No, what? I didn't step Oh no. Oh, I wasn't... Okay, we're gonna story mode that. I wasn't... I didn't think I even touched the grass, but I guess I must have. Alright, well, we know where everything's at, at least. As I start going the wrong way. So let's not trigger... Of unnecessary deaths. Remember when I said not to trigger any unnecessary deaths, and then I went ahead and triggered an unnecessary death? Okay, that was the best part. All right, we'll go around you. And... Monk... The, the apes? Apes up. Oh, the ape is up. Let's go this way, pick up the body parts. Yep. All right, so I'm not going to sprint until... Does he show up? Does he always show up when I get here? No, he doesn't. Okay, I'm very confused about the monkey's mechanics now. The ape does not seem to have any consistency. Sometimes he shows up and attacks you, and other times he's just like, nah, we cool. 
I must have hit the grass there. What is this? Uh, it's just something I can't interact with. Got it. Oh, wow. I almost just, I almost stepped in that. That'd have been bad if I did that. All right. So we want to loop around. Oh, there we go. So I now have the weed killer, which I needed for the tall weeds. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. No. No, 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 no. I'm not dying now to a monkey. Got it? I am going to survive. Oh, I, I've actually read this one already. But how do I get that one on the island? I need a boat or something, it seems. Oh, balls. Oh, that just happened again. I really gotta stop sucking. <laughs> That's pretty much what it comes down to. Just... Okay, I wasn't sure what was with that texture that flickered there for a second. I was wondering if that was like a possible hiding spot for the killer. And I was gonna say, that's annoying, but I can deal with it. Oh, cool, neat, awesome. So glad you could show up now. Let's just go around and then sprint when I get a chance. Oh boy, I almost walked into that tall grass. Yeah, I wish, I really wish I could understand what the monkey's about. That's, that's my one thing I wonder. Is that a wall, is that an entrance on the right hand side? A little pathway or something I can check out? It is. Interesting. I just say, this is actually, oh wow. I don't need to go that way, I can actually go through this left hand side and it's fine. Great. Good to know. Very, very good to know. Well, we're gonna go up this way and round. Oh, I just heard the monkey. Oh, I almost, I almost stepped in that too. I almost stepped hard into that. Don't, don't show up. Ooh, we're good. See, never, 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 never questioned it. I always knew we were good. I didn't. I'm also going the wrong way again. So from here, got the map, yeah, we, or we see the map, but doesn't, I came through here, what am I doing? I need the resort key, which I only have a right arm, a head, and some weed killer. So that's not gonna help me with that. Um, some blood, is this something I can go up? No. Oh, no, that's bad. Go, 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 go! Oh, I thought I was right there. Oh, I could have sworn I was there. It looks so close. But I know the shortcut now. <clears throat> I know where the shortcut is. Right over here. I don't have to loop around like I've been doing the entire time. Just go this way. Hey, look at that. We're in the house. So I can grab the weed killer, grab the head, grab the leg. We're golden. No problems. Boink. And I, I, I will admit, I totally missed it the first time. Go. Go, go, go before the monkey shows up. So I don't know where to go once I have those parts, though. Because I don't see anything that actually seems to lead that area. I was going to say, maybe the pier actually leads somewhere, but no, it doesn't seem to be the case. Is this closed? It doesn't actually... Maybe it's not closed. Let me try to go into that door. No. That doesn't, that doesn't do anything at all. All right. So I guess we're gonna go this way. Oh. This looks like stairs, honestly. Over here, this looks like stairs. I feel like I should be able to go up it or something. Let's try it. Oh, right, this little, oh, the little pathway into the house, which will give me the resort key. And if I could get past here, yes, this is good. Perfect, look at this. That's right, I forgot about that part. Right, because the girl got her head ripped off when the ape attacked her. And then apparently the ape took the key back because, you know, that's just proper manners, I guess? I don't... I don't know. Some, somebody put the, the key back. Was it a killer? Was it the ape? Who knows? Who cares? Something happened. So that's locked again, but there's nothing there. 
So once we get the... Once we get through here, we can get rid of the tall, tall weeds. Nope, that's not good. Oh, I'm stuck. Go this way, just reset the monkey. Should be fine. I can get the tall weeds. And then we can... Tall grass. Why... Oh my god, do I have to trigger him? Go, go, get out. Oh, I thought that was a, I thought that was a pathway. Oh, I think I have to go back to the hotel. I actually just like close my eyes so hard that I'm seeing stars. I'll jump ahead to where I get everything back. All right, we're back here. And now I'm actually wondering if I should have. Oh, that's bad. Oh, come on. He showed up right next to me. How's that fair? Okay, I'll try it again. I'm supposed to use the weed killer at the top part. That's what it was. That that makes it so much easier now. All right, so we gotta find that unmarked grave again, which I don't remember exactly where it was. I think it was to the right of here. I know that we need to go. Oh, there's another body part. Let's go ahead and grab that. Yep. Dodge, dodge these bear traps. What did I just get? I got a looks like a leg. I got a right leg. Good to know. Good to know which body part I have. Oh, that's the armor grave, actually. What am I doing? It's right here. And I got... What was that? Left arm. Okay, let's get out of here before the monkey shows up. Uh, oh, what did I just say? What did I just... Oh. Are you trying it? All right, we're back here. Which, as long as I don't step into a bear trap, I should be okay. I really wish there was some way I could recover from stepping in a bear trap, but I mean, realistically, once the killer's on you, the killer's on you. It makes sense. There's just no way to recover. Oh, boy. I completely missed that grass I just stepped on into. My own fault, I know. So, what I think the apes, the apes mechanic is when you hear that bang, like, just then, that means that he's in the area, and then if you run, he chases after you. But I can't confirm that because sometimes, like, it just show up randomly. Like, I changed screen, so I don't know if that resets him or what. But let's go down this way. No! No! Okay. That was weird, actually, because when I did that, I was wiggling A and D, and, my and there was like, blood all around me. So it was like, is there another way to die? Or can you actually get out of the bear traps? And I'm just not paying attention to what it's telling me to do. Also very possible as well, but I'll jump ahead for you all. All right, I got the I got the limb. Going back down this way. All right, not to step in bear traps or in the tall grass. I don't need to go to the left. I need to go down. So hopefully I can do this without. See, like right there. I don't know. You wait. Oh, the stupid monkey showed up right in front of me. I hate this monkey. I hate this monkey so much. All right. I made it through to the cemetery. So yay? Do I want to go? I'm thinking I want to go to the witch's house because I haven't actually seen anything necessary. Okay, we know that about the strange lights. Doesn't no. It, there's actually nothing at the witch's house. Okay, interesting. So I, I got to loop around. Hope the monkey doesn't show up at the last second. I'm looking for one more body part. I just don't know where it is. There's the, the key, the hotel room key. Yeah, we got that again. I don't think we actually need it though. Yeah, I don't see. So I have an arm, a head, a leg. Is that all I need? Maybe that's all I need for the ritual. It's totally possible, that might be it. Oh, I can actually go over this way too. Try to be careful. I don't know if that's tall grass or not, but I, don't, I really don't want to risk it. It's over this way. Oh, that's the name. Yeah, I'll read it. When the stars are right, sun and P will help me collect all parts of the ritual. We'll be together at last. Aye, aye. Yay. That's nice. Good for you, champ. Oh, no, 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 no. Not good for you. That's very bad for me. That's good for you. Bad for me. And I don't want to do things that are bad for me. I don't want to do things that are good for me. That, I honestly, we might just, I might have a, everything already. I've just been digging around this game for really no reason whatsoever. So, 
let's head to the ritual and see if I if I am missing anything. Cause I think of anything else I would need. This freaking monkey is the worst. Easily the worst part of this game. Did I just get another one? Oh, I just never got it before. Wait. Arm? Like... I must have not gotten it before. Or, okay, yeah, I, I must have not gotten it when I redid that. I'm sure this is fine. This is... Maybe, maybe the body part's there at the pier. That's a possibility. Right? A, a, not a great one, but a possible... a possibility. There's something there. Okay. Oh, I need left leg still. Okay, so I do need another body part. I don't like the sound of the monkey banking on things. Mm -mm, mm -mm, no siree. Not a fan of this at all. Let me get the safety. So this loops... Oh, that's... Okay, so that's, that just leaves me back here. I am missing a left... I'm missing the leg. I am missing a leg. What did I get? The torso. Okay, that makes sense. The biggest piece would probably be there. Because they wouldn't want to move it. But I'm missing the leg and I don't know where it would be at. Oh man, this is going to be killer trying to find this leg. <laughs> that was a bit of a pun, I guess. Let me see. I'm trying to see if there's anything that like stands out as... If I were to hide a body part, where would I hide it at? I do still have the shovel. So that's totally possible that I might have to dig somewhere again. Oh, come on! I... I hate this monkey. If it weren't for the monkey, I would've been fine. Jump ahead. I found it! It was on this screen. I had to, like, go around the grass patch. But I did find where the last piece is. <laughs> oh, man. So, yeah, that monkey, just the worst. He killed me like four times easily. Just as I got close to the edge of the screen, much like that. Oh, I just woke up everyone. Oh, boy. Okay. So I, after, like, that just, I think that proves my other theory about the monkey, possibly. When you hear the loud bang, get away from the edges. Because that's when he gets, he, he comes out. As long as you don't hear that bang, you should be all right. Because he always comes from an entrance. I mean, that just makes sense. But, I think it's related to the loud, like, do you hear first. And then when he's gone, you hear another do, and I think that's him leaving the area. But it's kind of weird, because sometimes it doesn't, it seems like I'm nowhere near the edges, and he's just like, hey, what's up? I'm going to show up now. Like that. See, that was, that was that. So that was telling me to get away from the edges. There we go. I think that's right. The, ki the, the the serial killer dude, he's easy. Just don't step in the, in the tall grass. The monkey though, that's the tricky one. I mean, look, I've seen Dunstan checks in, okay? I, I understand. Monkeys are devious. They, they start writing, I was actually, I was gonna say they start writing checks, but then I realized that was the movie, Blank Check, which I don't know how I confused that with Dunstan checks in, but I did. All right, so that's four body parts. I should be able to go up this way to the um, altar thingy. And I hope we're all right now. It's over here. Okay, so monkey's up. Monkey's active. Staying right in the middle of the screen. All right, that's fine. I'm okay with that, I guess. All right, so we're gonna start adding all the body parts. Continue the ritual. This must be enough. You begin the chanting as the hooded figures appear from one side of the island and the orangutan from the other side. Suddenly you see movement underwater. Finally, we'll be together again. This body is perfect. My dear husband. After all these years, my family is together again. With Igor, Iwa, and our dearest Bobo, we can restart the circus. Argentina sounds nice. <laughs> I got ending A. I'm guessing there's multiple endings depending on what you find. Um, it also might depend on if you find all the notes, which 
I'm missing two? Oh, I'm, I'm only missing the second note, which is the one on the island probably that I couldn't get before. Mm. All right, so yeah, that that's, this has been, um, oh God, I actually forgot the name of this game for a second. The thing, thing in the Lake, that's right. I had to double check that. Thing in the Lake uh, by the creators of World of Horror. It really shows, but it's his own style because the, the monochromatic is the developer's style basically. And it's enjoyable. I liked it a lot. But the change from being in a roguelike RPG to a top-down, almost Zelda, I, I guess, like Zelda-like game, actually really worked pretty well. The hell was that about? <laughs> this is really weird. All right, but I want to know what you guys thought, think about, thought about this game. So let me know in the comments down below. Give me a thumbs up. I really do appreciate that. And also make sure you're subscribed to so get this release new content or go live while live streaming. And as always, have a great day. Remember to burn bright. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Thanks for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to subscribe. And I also want to give a quick shout out to my Patreon supporters down below, Philip H. Chapman and Mega Co. If you want to see your name down here, there are links in the description to both my Patreon, Twitter, and Discord, as well as some merchandise if you'd like to pick some up. Thanks.